Did you know that you can power on your MacBook without pressing the power button? But why would you want to do that, you might ask? Well, the power button on modern MacBooks is either connected to or part of the logic board. So the problem is that if you liquid damage or otherwise fry your keyboard, you're effectively severing the power button's connection to the board, in which case no amount of pressing it will turn on your computer, even if your logic board is still perfectly good. The answer is to jump the power on pads, two tiny metal disks on your logic board. First, disconnect the keyboard cable to prevent interference, and then bridge the two pads with a metal object, and if the board is still good, it will power on. The common problem is that on any given board, the pads could be anywhere. The answer is poweronpads.com, a new feature of my website. Just select the year, laptop class, and screen size of your MacBook, and then click on the high resolution pictures to zoom in and see exactly where the power on pads are located. My goal is for this site to become the definitive resource for MacBook power on pads. If you can provide pictures or details of MacBook models not featured, please let me know and I'd be happy to include them. Again, that is poweronpads.com, an exciting new feature of my website, roadkillincorporated.com, where you can also sell your MacBook, buy a MacBook, ask me hardware related repair questions, and lots more. Thanks for watching, and I hope this tool improves your success rate repairing MacBooks.